Hey everybody, Steve here with uh, Press by One. Gonna try a new thing with our with our videos. Um, we're gonna be doing a recording. You can see me as I throw, and then uh, we'll also be able to see the dice as it goes out. You'll be able to see the betting as we go through and everything. What we're gonna do today is we're gonna do a uh, <clears throat> version of the Iron Cross. I know you're thinking. There's 20 million versions of Iron Cross. Yeah, well, this is my version of Iron Cross. But I'm sure somebody else has done it at some point because there's only so many different things you can do with the Iron Cross. What we're going to be doing is Iron Cross, we're going to press by one on everything. So we're going to press by one on the field, and we're going to press by one of the numbers as we go through. We're going to start off with a uh, $500, $500 uh, bankroll. And uh, let's just go, go and have some fun. What we're going to do is we're going to put uh, $10 on the pass line, $15 on the field, and then we're going to do 25 on the 5, 30 on the 6, 30 on the 8. So we're out $110 uh, is, the, is the bet. And then we'll just log on through. Uh, we're going to try to do four or five rounds as much as we can. And uh, let's just see what happens, all right? Here we go. And I apologize for the messiness in the back. I'm actually going to buy a screen or something, so that way I'll see that part. Anyway, but I don't have the screen yet, so let's go. All right, so we're going to get the money placed down to begin with. So we're going to put $10 in the pass line, $15 in the field. I'm going to have to top, uh, cap off the 6 and the 8, so I'll leave those there. And we're going to go ahead and we're going to put a quarter and 5. There's the 30 on 6, and there's the 30 on 8. And we are off. The dice are preset for my favorite. Uh, I'm going to do 3, 5, 3, 1, flying V. Normally my favorite is 3, 6, 3, 2, but we'll see how this goes today. Uh, so, come out roll. Are we working? Yes, we're working. I always work on the come out roll because, I don't know, I like working on the come out roll. All right, here we go. Here's the throw. Come out roll, make it good. One, three, four. One, three, four is our come out. So now this is an interesting one for us. We're gonna start off with something interesting right away because one, three, four, there's two things. Number one, we do pay the field. So the field pays 15. I'm gonna up it by five, press by one, and we'll collect some money off to the side. I thought I had an extra little, there it is. Sorry. We got the collect rack. So we're gonna collect. Now, four is our point. We have $10 on the line. I do like to make sure that I have at least $25 behind. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab a quarter, put it behind, hopefully the four hits again. Here we go. Next roll. And uh, there's a throw, nice and easy. Two, six, eight. Two, six, eight. So we'll get that moved up. Two, six, eight. We lost, lose the money in the field, so we lost that 20. Uh, didn't really lose it though because we still made $10 off that initial bet. So I guess we lost five in effect. Uh, but eight gets hit. Eight has 30, that's gonna pay 35. There's the $35. I'm gonna let a dollar of it stay behind because we're upping eight to 36. I'm gonna pay the 35. Put it over here in the bank, and let's reset the field back to 15. Next roll. I know, this is exciting, isn't it? All right. Nice easy throw. 426. 426. All right. So we're making some money doing this. So 426, we're going to lose the 15, but we're going to gain 35. Remember, we're gonna up every time, so we're taking six, put it on, pocket the rest, we're gonna put out our next 15. All right. Fourth roll. Still looking, really what we want is the, that four. We want the four to hit. And we got a three, so that pays the field. So three dollars, or three dollars, Three rolls, crap three. We have $15 in the middle, so that's going to pay $15. We're going to up it by one. We're going to pop it to 10. And we roll. We really want that four. 
A five, not a four. We got a five, no field five. So we lose for 20. That was in the middle. But we gained 35. We're gonna up by five, pocket, and bet. Next row. Boom, four, hard four. That's a good roll for us because we get paid twice. So first off, we get paid 15 in the middle. So there's the 15 in the middle. We're gonna up it and we're going to pocket. it. Now four was also our point. So we had $10 in the front. So that matches. Back we had 25. That's gonna pay 50 because it was the four. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna collect all that money and we're gonna stack it. And we're ready for our next roll. This is the come out roll, we don't have a point. Do we work on the come out? Yes, we do. We like working on the come out rolls. There's my throw. 617, terrible idea to work on the come out roll. That just stinks. I was just about to say, I roll, usually one out of 10 times, I'll roll a seven on a come out. And right as I started to say that, I rolled a seven. So I'm glad I didn't say it because then I would have felt I would have felt silly. All right, so we're gonna take all that money away. We're gonna cry a little bit. That money goes away. The only good thing about it is we win on the pass line. Woo! -hoo! All right, so we win the pass line. We're gonna take our fifteen dollars, put it back, back on the five, the six, the eight, and then we cap off the six and the eight. All right, stupid seven. But that same roller is still rolling. But in my case, I'm gonna kind of pretend like that one just died. So we're gonna make room for a new, we're gonna kind of pretend this is a new set of rolls in a way. Uh, are we working with the come out? Heck yeah. There's the throw. Three, two, five. Three, two, five. Can't be scared. Can't bet scared. Get right back into it. Three, two, five. Yeah, we lost, you know, $110 in effect on that first one, but we more than made $110. Plus, we made 35 on, you know, we made money in the original come out when we were working it, so I'm okay. So, anyway, no field five. We lose the 15. We gain 35. Up five in the middle, and we throw 15 on the field again. So, in a way, this is like our second roll. Two, six, eight. We're hitting a lot of that middle area, aren't we? Two, six. Oh, wait. Five is the point. Five is the point. So we're going to take that $30. We're putting it behind. All right. So we're good. Eight. We lose the 15, but we get paid 35. We're going to leave a penny and nickel behind. Make that 36. Pocket the rest. Putting 15 into the field. Next throw, 10th throw overall. Three, one, four. Three, one, four, that's a field hit. <clears throat> Three, one, four. So we have 15 in the field. That's gonna go up to 30. Leave five behind, pocket the 10. And we roll. Hopefully I like this view. Let me know if you think it's kind of cool. Five, we hit the point. Let me know if you like it or not. It's something new, something different. I haven't seen anybody else kind of do this thing, so I thought I would. All right, two, three, five uh, is what gets paid. The five, um, <clears throat> excuse me, five, we're gonna get paid even on the front line. Back line uh, gets paid uh, one and a half to one, so I've got 30, that's gonna pay me $45. So there's the five, there's the 45, there's that, and we lost that in the middle. All right, but overall, we still did very well with that roll. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take from the winnings out, we're gonna reset the field, and let's play.
There's the throw. Four, six, ten. Four, six, ten. So we just established, so we just hit the point. Now we establish a new point. Four, six, ten. So that's going to do two things for us. First off, it's going to pay us for the field. So we get 15. And now remember, I want at least 25 behind the line. So I'm just going to take five reds. One, two, three, four, five. And now I got 25 behind the line, hoping that we hit 10 again. And the throw. Six. One, five, six. That's okay. We're, we're really not doing much in the field today other than just giving away some money. So um, 15 goes away. Our six has got 30, so it's gonna pay 35. We're gonna drop a penny, leave six behind. So now we've got 36 on six and eight. And where's my money for five? I think I took it, I didn't put it back up. So I'm gonna, anyway, that takes care of it all. So we had $30 left, we got paid. Um, pocket that, realize I don't have anything on five. So I'm gonna throw a quarter real quickly on five. And I'm gonna throw my 15 back into the field. Now that was weird, all of a sudden I'm like, wait a second, something's not jiving here. I think when I paid myself, I just took all the money. All right, there's the roll, weird roll, three, one, four. Three, one, four, one of the dice, I don't know if you can see on it, uh, one of the dice came out really high, and so not normally the way it should throw. So 15 pays 30, and we're gonna leave dollar, or leave five, we're gonna pocket 10, and we keep on rolling. This is a pretty good hand, actually. Five, three, eight. So it's our first repeater uh, that we've had in a while, other than the two points that we hit. So five, three, eight. We have thirty-six. That's going to pay forty-two. So there's our forty-two. <clears throat> we lose the money we had in the middle. We're going to leave six behind this time, <clears throat> and we're going to pocket, and we're going to pay. Awesome. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> Little cough going on. All right. Next roll. Let's see if we can keep this going for a while. Four, six, ten. Look at that. We hit the point. Man, if we're doing fire bets, we'd be doing really well because we've hit three of them already, I think. So that's good. So four, five, ten. Point gets hit. Also gets the middle. So let's do this in order. So there's the field bet. Field uh, wins, it's got 15, wins 15. We're gonna keep 10, or keep five on there, pocket 10. Front line pays one for one, that's 10. Back line, we have 25, it's gonna pay 50. There we go. And so what we're gonna do is we're collecting all of this money and we continue to play. Still have five, six, and eight out there. Still looking good. And there's the throw. Three, uh, five, six, uh, five, three, eight. That's a lot easier to say in my mind than in my mouth. All right, so make some room here. So 42 is going to pay, let me see that's six units, so, uh, 42 is going to pay 49. Yep, 42 is going to pay 49. I'm going to drop a dollar. I'm going to get paid 50. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to put 6 back up there. So now we're at 48 on 8. We lost our 20 in the middle. So we need to reset that. There we go. And our point is now eight. So we're gonna take this 48, we're gonna bring it down. We're gonna add two onto it. That gives us 50. One, so the quarter right there, so we're gonna add another quarter. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. So we're gonna grab another quarter, put it behind, clean up the look. $50 behind on the, on the eight. So we're hoping to hit the eight again. 
That would be very nice. There's the throw. Boom! Two, six, eight. Ask and ye shall receive. Two, six, eight. Awesome sauce. Two, six, eight. That was quick work of that number. We did lose the field, but we got $10 on the front. On the back, we have 50, which means it's going to pay 60. There we go. Now that is going to be the, we were at 48 on eight, so now it would be, a, I'd call it 54. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put 54 back out there. It's 48 when we hit it, we brought it down, now we hit again, and uh, we'll put it back up at 54. Man, this is a long roll. This is good, no complaints. There's a throw, three, five, eight. We are liking some eights today, that is for sure. So, we have 54 out there, which means that's nine units, nine times seven is 63. So it's gonna pay $63. There's the $63, and we're going to make it look like, we're going to make 8 look like 60. Behind the line. And we're going to take the winnings, and we're going to pocket them, put our field bet back out there, and 8 <clears throat> is great. Let's see if we get 8 again. Normally, you know, things aren't going to go like this, but this one is 369, 369, center field, 9. So, finally, oops, that just flipped. Y'all see that? Both of them flipped. That's 369. That's why I call it out right away. I'm terrible with a stick. All right, so 15. We're going to keep one. Pocket the 10. Everything's good. Next roll. Snake Eyes, that's a good number for us, isn't it? Because that's going to 2x in the field. So our $20 that we had just won us $40. And we're going to let the quarter stay. We're going to pocket the rest. That was a cool number. That's our first time we've hit a 2 or a 12 today. So let's keep rolling, 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 rolling. Keep those, oh, we hit it again. Snake eyes back to back. Gotta love life sometimes. So the 25 is gonna pay 50. We're gonna pocket 50 and we're gonna up field. Field's now at 30. I don't you think that if we've been rolling, if we rolled Snake Eyes twice, it's only fair that we roll Box Cars once. So let's do Box Cars right here. Ready? Box Cars, Midnight! 10, hard 10. Not Midnight, but there's a lot of dots out there. Hard 10, too bad we're not playing any hard ways, because the only thing 10 does for us is it does pay us 30 bucks. So 30 bucks. We're gonna keep five on, so now we have 35 on the field, and we pocket. Here we go. Next throw. There we go, and seven. You know, it had to happen. Four, three, seven. So that's actually our second seven we've had. But that roll from the last time we did the seven, so the first time we did seven, we went one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rolls. On the seventh roll, we hit the seven. That time, we went 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17th roll, hit the 7. So, let's, uh, let's do a quick little regroup here. Get rid of some money off the table. And, if you remember how I like to play, I do like to, I do like to kind of count up a little bit in between reset rolls like that. The first time we rolled the seven, remember it was on the come out roll, so it was still kind of rolling. And so uh, I didn't want to stop and count anything because 
that was still rolling. So in this case, it'd be like we're going to a new shooter. Uh, of course, it's just me here, so we're not going to a new shooter. But that was a very profitable, profitable run. So if you remember, we uh, started with 110. We did lose out once and had to park another 110 in. And so, uh, so that was unfortunate. So we're 220, we're $220 in right now. And let's just see where we are. So we have $200 stacks that we're going to just collect two blacks for real fast. We've got one, we have one green stack. That's $500. So one, two, three, four, five. All right. So after one round, we are, we might as well do the same thing with the whites. One, two, three, four, five. Go ahead and color up the whites too. Don't leave them out. So after one round, we're one, two, three, four, five, six, seven hundred, seven fifty, seven sixty, seven hundred sixty-two dollars in the plus, minus the two twenty. So we're still plus five hundred dollars. Uh, I don't think any of you or me would be complaining about that. So let's go ahead. We're going to just do one more little quick round, uh, or as quick as it goes, and we'll see what happens. We are 22 minutes in, uh, so what we'll do is we're just gonna get, once we get closer to 30, I'm just gonna call it, call it a day and uh, see what happens. So one, two, three, one, two. All right, so let's do this. This is our 25th overall throw. I have 25 dice that I always preset, and uh, this is the 25th one. Come out, roll, am I working? Yes, I'm working. All right, here we go, there's the throw. Five one six five one six. That is good for us because I like that number. All right, so we lose fifteen in the middle. We pocket that, but we get uh, we have thirty five. Or we get paid thirty five. I'm gonna take uh, I'm gonna take reds. One two three four five six seven. Thirty five dollars. We're going to up the six thirty six. And we put our $15 in the field, and we continue to play, but I need to reset some dice. So I'm gonna take the first set of dice that we had, which were, we did seven rolls, remember? So let's see if, uh, let's see how these do. I've gotta reset them though. Uh, three, five, three, one, that was easy one to reset. And there's the throw. Snake eyes, wow. Three snake eyes so far. That is quite cool. So we have 15, it's gonna pay us 45. And I'm gonna just collect, I need, I need reds so we can keep clean the field. So I need 45, there's one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. So there's that, I'm gonna put uh, $5, $5 in and just pocket the rest. We don't have a point yet. Do we? Yeah, we do the point six. What am I thinking? The point is six, so that means that the uh, $36 that we have actually goes behind, and that's $35. I'll just leave it at 35. Could take it up to 50, but eh, we won't be greedy. All right, here we go, three, five, three, one. Nice, easy toss. Six, five, 11, yo, 11. So we pay our field. So our field, uh, we have 20. So we're gonna get paid 20. One, two, three, four. And we're gonna drop one on there. So we have 25 now on the field. Whoops, I put the six, five one over here. Should've put it right there. All right, next roll. Three, five, three, one. Nice, easy toss. Six, two, eight. Six, two, eight. Why did it take us so long to get another eight? He asks sarcastically. So we lose our field, but we gain uh, 35 right there. So I'm gonna pay that. 
Oh, we need to up the eight by six. So there, now we got 36, and we have 15 back in the field. We're still looking for that six. So it'd be great to get the six. Uh, let me see, three, five, three, one. Nice, easy toss. Six, baby, hard six. That was a nice roll, we'll take it. So that hit the six, that hit the point. So now we did lose the middle of the field, but we gain two, we gain 10 on the front. On the back, we have 35, that's seven units, because uh, seven times five is 35, and seven times seven is 49. So I'm gonna drop a penny, and I'm gonna collect 50. And uh, yeah, we're gonna collect the money, put that back up, and we're going to put our field back out, pocket that 50 bucks. Here we go. Reset the dice one more time. Three, five, three, one. And nice, easy throw. Four, three, seven. Not as nice as it could have been. But you know what? We're gonna go ahead and call this, uh, we're gonna call this good. You get the idea of how to play this strategy. Uh, the key thing for you to do, one thing that I did uh, that you could have done differently is when I would hit a, when I, you know, when I would land at a point, I would up it and I'd move it below. You could just take the whole amount and parlay it behind. Uh, that's a decision for you to make. Uh, we had, uh, what, the first roll went seven, the second roll went 17, third roll went all of one, two, three, four, five, six. So uh, averaged out to be, what, 13, 30, I averaged 10 rolls uh, per time. I hit some hard ways, that was good. So let's see what our overall uh, take is. What's our, what's our overall winnings? Let's go ahead and clear the table first off. And then, uh, is that everything? Yep. All right, well, let's see. Well, we're mostly counted up already. But one, two, three, four, five. We'll get one more red. Oops, one more red. One, two, three, four, five. And then... Five, five, and then we're short, so we get three greens on that. So there's our three greens. Add it with these two greens. One, two, three, four, and four, even $200. So what did we end up with, my friends? We started off with a, a chip stack of $500, or $400, $400. We ended up with $400 to start with, and we're counting out one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So nine hundred dollars. So take away the four hundred that we started with. We profited five hundred fifteen eighteen. Five hundred and eighteen dollars profit uh, using the modified version of the Iron Cross. And it took all of twenty almost thirty minutes to do. Not a bad hourly rate. That's it for this one. Uh, Hope you enjoyed it. We'll try this again another time, uh, maybe with a little bit more money, see what happens, and uh, that's it. Bye, y'all.